Tonight's Health Watch, a brand new way to help patients with severe neck pain. An artificial disc replaces a herniated disc in the neck. CBS 2's Dr. Max Gomez here to show us how it all works. You know, there's always been a problem with artificial joints. Hips and knees, they've been around for decades, and they're now much more like a natural joint. Artificial discs have been around for a few years, too, first in the lumbar spine and then in the cervical or neck spine. This new one, though, is very close to a natural disc. Meet Joanna Lopez, a happy and clearly very active 29-year-old. And about two and a half years ago, she got into a car accident. I had pain up all throughout my neck and to my, uh, like, the upper back. I would have headaches every single day. I would get migraines probably three to four times a week. Didn't sleep ever, like never ever. Three hours of sleep was a lot for me. Her former lifestyle on hold, Joanna tried a number of conservative therapies to ease the pain. I tried physical therapy, I did massage therapy, acupuncture, chiropractic therapy, and I got epidural injections. Nothing worked. Then Joanna heard of Dr. Fabian Bitan, chief of spine surgery at Lenox Hill Hospital, who was one of the first surgeons in the country to use a just FDA approved artificial disc for the cervical spine. The new M6 disc is one of the first discs that gives a motion. It's basically compressive, and this mimics the natural motion. The M6 disc is even built to mimic a natural disc with a ring or annulus of strong fibers surrounding a springy center or nucleus with titanium plates that secure the disc to the vertebrae above and below. Joanna had the new disc inserted just two weeks ago. It's a delicate procedure that requires training to get right. But in the end, Joanna should be able to move her neck in all directions with very few restrictions. I'm already feeling better than I was. Like, I, I still have pain, but it's a totally different pain. I'm very hopeful just from how I feel now. I am very hopeful. Now, in most cases, patients can wait to see if conservative therapy will heal a herniated disc. But after two months or so, the herniation can start to calcify and create a more difficult problem. But the new disc isn't for everyone with a bad neck. Arthritis in the little facet joints of the spine or instability in the neck probably disqualifies you. And as a veteran who had fusion done maybe 20 years ago where I had to wear a collar for two months, the fact that she's up and around and moving her neck like that after two no. weeks is just remarkable. Amazing. She can walk in the whole bit. The whole, yeah, the whole thing. But more importantly, she's got That's this kind of motion. That's yeah. really remarkable. I mean, because there's so much going on there. So many difficult. All right. Thanks, Thank you, guys. Dr. Mark.